Mikhail, welcome to Arsenal. You've described transfer deadline day as a crazy day. Just tell us your story of how the move came about. Well, I knew the interest uh, from the club for about a week or so, but uh, they were still deciding. I wasn't sure if Everton uh, wanted to sell me as well. So they decided to wait till the last day. And obviously, to get everything done in 24 hours is not easy. But uh, finally, we, we got it done and uh, we are happy. It brings to an end a six-year spell at Everton. How difficult was it to leave there? Well, it's been a, a great experience for me being uh, a club like Everton. It's, um, I really enjoyed it. I have left uh, so many friends and uh, it's, been, it's been hard to say goodbye to everyone. Uh, I've got really good friends and people that really, really look after me in those six years. And, uh, and the fan base is unbelievable as well at Everton. And uh, I really hope that everybody understands the, my decision and the club's decision because I think it's in the best interest of, of every part. So it's been nearly a week since the move came about. What have you had to do since then? Well, on Wednesday night, I get all the paperwork done. On Thursday as well. On Friday, I went to the club, say goodbye to everyone, manager chairman, all the teammates, all the staff. And uh, on Friday night I moved to London because I want to get settled as quick as possible. So we're in the hotel now with the family, looking for houses, areas, nurseries, you know. But I want to get it done as soon as possible so I can focus on, on the training and the games. I suppose international break's a good time to do it. What makes Arsenal such an attractive option for you? I always been a big admirer of, uh, of the Arsenal philosophy, the way they play, the way they think that uh, that they have to do the job, and uh, and it's always exciting watching Arsenal play. And uh, I've been, I was a Barcelona boy. That was my first team, and uh, they've got exactly the same philosophy. So in England, it's not a better team to watch on TV than Arsenal. You played against Arsenal many, many times. What are your memories of those games? We had some good games against uh, against Arsenal, and uh, I can't wait to start playing. I can't wait to to go and and play at the Emirates. I think it's an unbelievable stadium, and uh, I'm so excited. You know a lot about Arsene Wenger, of course. What do you think he'll be like to work with? Well, he seems uh, really calm and really confident, and uh, he's has shown that confidence, like bringing so many young, talented players to the squad while everybody else was spending a lot of money on them and um, and I think his most important thing is that he wants to play good football and then win and uh, I like that. You're 29 years old now, do you think Arsenal are getting you at your peak? Hopefully, I think I've got the right experience in England and all over my career and, and I can help uh, the team, the young lads here with, with some of it. And I think I've got the best two or three, four years of my career ahead. You mentioned England there. Some players never quite get to grips with English football. Why do you think you've been such a success in the Premier League? Well, I think I spell, uh, my spell in Scotland when I was 20 for two years, I think was really important. Some people didn't understand that move, but uh, I knew that if I wanted to play in England, I had to tough up and, and get used to the, the pace of the English football. And uh, it was a great experience for me. And, and obviously my spell at Everton it has helped a lot. But uh, obviously there are things in your game that you need to change and adapt. And uh, that's what I try to do. So no need to get used to a new league, but you have got new teammates, a new style of play to get used to. How long will that take? Hopefully not long, but uh, obviously you need to meet all new characters, new personalities and, and new players with different abilities that you need to pick up as soon as possible to get a good understanding on the pitch. So I've been watching a few of the videos and, and get some work done before the training and, and hopefully that will help. And speaking of new characters, Arsenal very busy in the transfer deadline week. Santos, Mertesaka, Ben Ayun and Park also new signings. What do you know about them? Well, I think we've got some experience there uh, from, from all of them. And uh, we have a strength in nearly every position in the team, which I think is important because we're going to be playing in four competitions. So hopefully they can 
all add something different to the team and, and get the team performing better.